What's up, y'all? It's your boy eBay Fight Predictions in the building, and we got some breaka breaka breaking news uh, today via Brett Akimoto. Uh, Kumar Usman and Jorge Masvidal will be your tough coaches. Pre Dana White, uh, I get it. I understand why they're doing this. Uh, it makes sense. At the end of the day, the first fight did really big numbers. You know, could be not not could be, but Dana kind of I think regrets uh, not being able to book. Um, you know, could be versus Connor. So I think, you know, you know, the rematch, obviously. So I think he wants to take advantage of this moment and be able to rebook, um, you know, Usman and Jorge too. Um, the good thing about this matchup, even though we know who's going to win, Jorge hasn't lost anyone but Usman, uh, in his last, what, four fights, right? Um, you know, that's the good thing. Uh, so it's like at least he's coming off a loss to Usman. He doesn't look any worse. He's top five. Uh, so that's a good thing. But like, and obviously six days notice. They don't like each other. It's drama. But man, to reward this fucking clown with a title shot is atrocious, man. I, I is like, it makes you think doesn't even matter about winning anymore. You know, like, like I'd get it if, or Jorge got robbed in his last few fights, or or he had really close fights or whatever. You know, I would get it. But he he's not like he got destroyed by Usman. You know, he lost in my humble opinion all five rounds. The first round was really close, and I could see the debate to give Jorge the first. But even if, even if that, it's like one you know one four right. So I don't obviously. I think Jorge will put put up a better fight, but you know at the same time Usman, he also had to deal with adversity, of uh, you know having a late uh, notice uh, change in opponents. So, you know it, it's gonna be a, a hard one for him. I thought Usman did not look good in that fight, and I thought he could have done a lot better. But yeah, it is what it is. At the end of the day, um, I'm somewhat disappointed that Jorge. Uh, didn't want to fight Colby, but this is something we should have expected. Colby and Jorge, well, Colby now isn't saying it anymore, but, back, you know, when were they were supposed to be friends, they said they'd only fight each other for gold. So if you believe that Jorge and Colby are, you know, still best friends in secret and they're trying to work everybody, like pro wrestling uh, style and, uh, you know, uh, trying to trick everybody, then this kind of goes into your, you know, uh, into that belief. It's just interesting that H Colby is calling for the fight. Which is interesting. So it kind of goes against that. But they did say they'd never fight each other if it wasn't for a belt. So it is really, really interesting. I don't know if they're you know, bringing up momentum. I don't know if they're trying to plan uh, for either one to beat Marty, to take Marty out of the way so they can end up having this super fight. Uh, but at the end of the day, it, we're in a really, really hard situation with, uh, with that welterweight division. Usman... You know he is he has been truly dominant in the in the division. You know obviously he's had a close fight with Colby, but besides that, you know and he had a bit of a it was a good fight with Burns, but he ended up dominating uh, after the first round. So it's a really really hard you know division. Usman is really really becoming super dominant. Um, you know I I really don't see Jorge being able to uh, to do it at the end of the day. Um, it is what it is. They should have. It makes more sense to do Colby and Usman too than than this fight. You know, this is this is all money. Uh, you know, and Jorge has been such a hypocrite lately. And it, you know, it is what it is at the end of the day. Like I'm not tripping about it too hard. It's like I don't care. It's it's gonna be exciting to see the trash talk. I, I will watch Tough because they are two big names and it is a title on the line. But uh, in terms of an early prediction, I'm going fourth round ground and pound TKO. Usman, I, I'm praying to God he fucking smashes this dude's face. I'm really praying he smashes his face because uh, Jorge deserves it at the end of the day. But it is what it is. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, don't forget to follow me on my Instagram. Don't forget to follow me on my Twitter. Uh, if you're new, subscribe, like, comment, uh, share the video. Also, click the notification button. It's your boy, eBay, Fight Prediction. And I'm out.